you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl angelic and i'm back with another video we are back you guys i've been running errands all day and i just wanted to make this quick little video and kind of tell you guys how i'm feeling after graduation um it's officially been five days since we graduated and i can't tell you the amount of relief that i feel right now like it's just a peace and serenity that I can't even begin to explain right now. Um, I feel like that with my fiance too. We like it makes it better, but I feel like um, I feel like going into the field is going to be a different type of stress. Obviously, I know that, but I don't know how to explain it. Like you just my light, like my head feels lighter, my shoulders are intense. I feel like I can breathe and I just the feeling of peace and just like oh my god like nothing holding you down is like a feeling that I can't really describe you know it's funny because my fiance was telling me yesterday he's like like do you feel like you're less stressed like and Cause I feel like you can tell too like I just I feel like relaxed you know um, because when I do get stressed out I get a little tense and I'm very like but I think that's normal with stress and just in general when people go through things um, I'm very grateful that you know that like my fiance was down for the ride and like it's really hard dating a person who's in the medical field you guys like I think in those type of fields where like you're dealing with like crazy stuff every day and just it's very hard to kind of like but um you know it's just it's it's just amazing that the amount of like relief that I feel you know and we're getting ready to take our board soon so I'm really excited about that um, I'm actually very relaxed about that too. Um, you know, we did take our exit exams and uh, our practice simulations at school. Um, I did very well on the TMC uh, practice mock. Got a high cut score. The simulations I am having a bit of trouble with. I'm not even gonna lie. I know that for the simulations I am gonna have to study a lot and even for the TMC I know that I'm gonna have to study a lot but um I feel like I have the appropriate resources for the TMC uh however for the simulations I don't know about that but um I went ahead and purchased uh respiratory therapy coach and let me tell you guys that man really breaks it down like his name is Joe he really breaks down the areas of the TMC um, and just I feel like I learned so much with him in just two days when I because I purchased that pro like the course I want to say three days before we had to take our practice TMC and I got so much information that I felt like that really helped me when it came time to take the exit exam um, I was really freaking out for the exit exam, you guys, because I was like, I can deal with having to retake the TMC or whatever, the simulations, whatever I have to do, but having to retake a class and, like, go through clinicals again, just, like, it was, like, terrifying me. I really didn't want to do that. Um, I, I just felt like I had a lot to lose, and... I'm done like I'm literally done like I don't I didn't want to just I didn't want to be in that position and um, so I felt like that's what impulsed me and like pushed me to kind of like get my shit together and like flip everything around you know and I'm the type of student that like I start off pretty rocky in the beginning of the semesters but I always like turn the whole boat around you know what I'm saying like I kind of changed gears and I'm like, okay, Angelica, you need to get your shit together. Like, it's time to actually get down to the nitty gritty. So, I don't know if it's a good thing or bad thing, but that's just the type of student that I was. Um, and I'm very, I'm just happy, you guys. Like, I'm happy that this is finally done and over with. 
and we can start like kind of like moving forward in life and like seeing what's gonna happen next um like i did tell you guys i did have a job offer lined up already um i'm going through the process of the background check and stuff but things might change just because um my fiance did apply for a new position within his company now which is like a higher position but it's going to require him to kind of like relocate to a whole new city so i might have to like relocate over there and that's totally okay like i don't mind um i'll look for a new job but um i definitely want us to both be at a good place in our careers where we're both happy and whatever ends up happening is like fine so um yeah definitely um yeah that's kind of where we are um so i'm just gonna focus right now on taking the tmc and then later on taking the simulations so that is where we are you guys um i don't know if i'll start working once i get my crt yet just because um i did i did what was it um I know that there's a couple of hospitals that do CRTs and like RRTs. The hospital that I'm in the process with now only wants RRTs. Um, I don't think they're accepting CRTs anymore. Um, there's a hospital in my city where they are taking CRTs, but I think you have like a, a time span to get your RRT. I'm not sure. Um, but I do know that. Uh, so yeah, it's kind of like, I'm kind of like iffy about it because like, let's say I started working as a CRT, I'm going to have to do like a whole transition and I just rather, I just want to really get the RRT first and just get it out of the way already. Um, but we'll see what happens, you guys. Um, I'm really excited for this new chapter and I'm excited to take you guys along with me. Um, so yeah, that's kind of where we're at, we're at right now. Um, I'm going to make a separate video kind of showing you guys the study materials that i've used and like what's helped me uh i think there's a different learning style for everybody and i really had to find mine because at the beginning i remember that i had my own learning style right and i felt like i was doing better on that learning style and then i tried to transition it to kind of try it out with my group um that i had at school and that didn't work out for me so i kind of had to reroute and go back to my old study habits and that really helped me um but i will go ahead and more into depth about that in a separate video um i definitely want to answer more questions so if you guys have any questions regarding the rt program or um all that jazz i can definitely make a separate video about that um what else trying to think but yeah you guys we are done with RT school I'm super excited that you guys were here throughout the journey even though I feel like I could have gave you guys a little more context but uh, it gets very difficult you guys when when we're studying and when you're in actual RT school or even nursing school like any medical school um a lot of your time has to go to studying so you don't really have time to do much else honestly um i remember when i first started rt school i was i was like i was like taking it easy the first you know a like couple months and then you start realizing like whoa hold on you really have to put like a thousand percent into this like you no longer have a social life like you no no longer have like your boo thing your, your husband your your whatever they they kind of have to be on the same page as you and that's why i'm really grateful that my fiance was super understanding because like a thousand percent of your time has to go to your studies like there's no ifs buts around it and if you don't have a supportive partner like it's gonna be really hard honestly because obviously they want attention and like i did my best to give my fiance like 
his attention and which I feel like I did I made time for him but at the same time he knew that like we really had to study because like this is our future you know what I'm saying so I'm thankful that he was really understanding about that and he kind of like rode the wave with me so I think that kind of made me like love him more even though I, I already I feel like I love him the most like there's levels to the love you know what I'm saying like I feel like I've always <laughs> I've always loved him so much but I feel like this has proven like more of like just made me fall more in love with him if that makes sense you know what I'm saying so I was already in love with him but it's like this made me fall more in love with him so um yeah you guys uh definitely definitely I think that was one of the kind of challenges with RT school is just friendships and stuff like that you know I didn't really have much time for it and it was just like a lot you know because literally you're waking up you're going to school clinicals and then you go home you're tired you don't want to do anything but you have to study like in order to retain the information you have to study and then the next day it's like you're doing it all over again all over again all over again and honestly it flies by honestly it really does because i feel like i just started yesterday and like it's been a whole year and x amount of months you know what i'm saying so it's crazy but i will definitely keep you guys updated you guys are gonna go through the journey of with of with uh, you guys are gonna go through the journey with me of just this new chapter you guys like i'm really excited to share this with you guys and like i don't know like we're in this together <laughs> i wish i could give you a virtual hug but we're in this together and um the security guard is totally coming to my car right now just kidding but um we're definitely in this journey together you guys and i'm excited to share more with you and um let's go apartment hunting soon we're gonna have to start looking in a new, whole different city um the city that we were originally looking in we had a good we went ahead and saw more apartments um which i'm gonna start filming more for you guys about that but we started looking at more apartments and we kind of decided on one but the fact that you know we might have to relocate um kind of changes the whole ball game so yeah you guys um i will catch up with you i keep saying um a lot i'm gonna try to change that all right But yes, you guys, we will go ahead and keep you updated. I feel like I'm congested, honestly. I feel like I'm congested. I sound really congested right now, but. Uh, I will catch up with you guys very soon. I'll talk to you later.